Welcome to the Virtu Motors Arena, home of the Newcastle Eagles. But no basketball today. Instead, we have STEM Fest, three days of STEM activities, over 3,000 kids, more than 60 companies from the Northeast who are going to be changing the world. Let's go and have a look. So here we are, this is what it's all about, STEM Fest. We have got over 60 companies here, all of whom have offices in the Northeast. Some of them are massive companies like BP uh, and Lockheed Martin, but there's also smaller companies too. And we've divided the room up into four different areas. We've got the Space Zone that looks at everything from launch and building satellites, cybersecurity and technology, environment and energy, all the way through to manufacturing. And it is a fantastic event that gets people who work in the industry to talk to young people, young people who are thinking about what they might want to study at university or study for careers. And it's a lot of fun. The world is changing beyond recognition. The future that young people are going into is going to be beyond anything we could imagine. And a lot of the challenges that we face are going to be helped and solved by scientists and engineers, which is really what STEM Fest is all about. We've divided it up into four main areas. So we've got space that looks at everything from building small satellites and launch, everything from GPS to understanding climate change. And of course, we've got cyber security. It's one of those areas that is increasingly important as our world becomes more and more digital. Energy and environment, there is nothing more important than climate change. It is our big existential crisis that we're facing. So all these companies down here are thinking about ways of tackling that problem. And then, of course, manufacturing how we build things. All of the people who work in these areas are finally getting a chance to talk to young people to actually explain what it is they are doing and to inspire young minds, to get them thinking about careers and things they might want to do in further education, whether to do with science, technology, engineering or maths.